what the f <laughs> I'm glad I have ghost. <laughs> I hear you. Has spawned. Oh, let's go, boys. It's time. I don't know if they even had like the CC to kill me though, is the thing. But that being said, all good. Okay, get a little poison auto on Cassante. We're gonna look to shove on wave two. Okay, second wave is here. So I'm gonna start my push. So we Lee got his uh his red buff. That's the price they pay for invading me. Oh, wait, Vigo's in our red. I could go over there, but it's not worth it, I think. There's no one else coming, so... Not worth it. Okay, walk down. Oh, it's Zack support. That makes way more sense. I was like, hold on. Hey, I don't know if I'm gonna kill the cannon. i probably leave it up, actually, this time. I don't have TP, right? And I think no TP, I should leave it up. Because that way it pushes back towards me, it won't freeze. Do I go Dark Seal or Boots? I'd probably go Boots because I have no Ghost up. Nice, good flush. I don't think he realized that this, this will not freeze for him. That's what he's trying to do. But the cannon's alive. It's going to push towards me no matter what. Nice try there, Cassandy. Do I get XP? Tell me I get XP for it still. Do I actually get it? Oh my god. The boots were worth it. They paid for themselves. Almost. Okay, he's going to play it back a bit. I don't want to fight him if I can avoid it here. His wave is huge. My play worked out. I got my cannon. I got the wave reset. I didn't get it frozen on. We just chill. Not for free, bud. Not for free. Get out of here. Nope. Don't think so. I invented that strat. Forces recall there. There's his TP as well. Very nice. Okay, just look to shove here. We don't need to get uh, this backline of minions, the range minions. I can just look uh, look to walk around here. Because I'll try and freeze it again, see? Or I guess not. Maybe he's had enough of me. Either way, I get a proxy here. He bought call. I'm going to buy call too, actually. I'm going to match call for call. You're not getting away with that one either, dude. Nothing. Nothing for free. I'm more than happy to go call for call. This is absolutely playable on Singed. <laughs> is if we're gonna get into a farming war, then I wanna be able to cash out as well, right? He's 15 ahead on his, cause he, he bought it before this recall. But it won't matter that much. It'll be okay. It's pretty low mana. Okay, he goes for a proxy here under wave three, or tur under, under turret three. It's totally fine. He's like kinda low mana though, for what it's worth. And I got my cannon. It's fine. Uh, I could actually theoretically double proxy as well. If I want to finish my call even faster than him, I could totally double proxy. Don't know if I will, but I could. Okay, let's go around here. 
has been slain. He might try and fight me because he is level 6. This is the best chance for him to do it. Okay, back out. W. E. If you W him, he can't stun you with his unstoppable ability. Whatever that one's called. I forget. If um, Zed is not roaming, then I'm not going to double proxy because I don't want to troll him on a CS. That would be a little too much, I think. I hear you. What I can do, though, is go on their base. And does not double proxy. Just single, just single proxy it. Just to tilt him. It's a tilt factor. That's the only reason I'm going in. My team is stomping, and I want them to tilt. Rampage. I want to win the mental war here. Shut down. When is it time to go call on Singed? If the enemy top laner has called, then you should buy it, I think. I just wasted so much of his time. Oh my god. <laughs> we get a mid plate for that, dude. Holy shit. <laughs> Guy's pissed. Hi, buddy. <laughs> no way, man. When you buy a call and proxy on the enemy base, and your jungler gets herald for it. And the enemy mid ganks you, and you survive. My goodness, dude. It's disgusting what I just did to them. He's tilted out of the game now. There's no way this guy wants to play the game anymore. Double proxy is when you farm mid and uh, top wave. I didn't take it, though, because I don't want to troll my Zed. Uh, because my Zed was still pushing mid lane. So if I do that, I'm sealing his CS technically. I only want, you only want double proxy if your mid laner is roaming bottom. That's the only, that's the only situation where it's worth it. Unless you are, unless your team is like out of the game and you want to try and Hail Mary a play. Otherwise I would only single, single proxy it. Least annoying singe, true. Tower shot, tower shot. There it goes, later, buddy. Oh, he's heralding for me too? I think I get ahead of him on call now too. I think I do actually. His TP is down for 20, so I get ahead of him on call as well. Amazing. No, I don't get ahead that I go even on call. I get a super head on tower plates though. Oh, wait, I thought it was down, damn. Very nice. There's his TP again. An enemy has been slain. An enemy has been slain. On my way. Okay, we'll go ahead and recall here. Viego died in his top side camps are up, so don't want to stay. Sell potion. I could also sell um or sell nothing and just buy Swifty boots here, but I want to get demonic embrace this game. I'm probably gonna get Leandris too this game actually because they have four melee champions, two tanks. So Leandris or Riftmaker are both really good for me here this game. Yeah, I don't understand why it's like Cassante is a very lane dominant champion. I at least against Singe he is, right? 
but he's playing him like like he's a weak champion early game. This is this is what Singe does because Singe is weak early game unless you have Ignite, but then you have low mobility, so it's kind of a trade off, right? If he just tried to fight me, he could probably beat me at least once, but he's not trying at all. I proxied the man one time and broke his mental completely. Guys, like, I'm never laning normally again. Fuck this. I've had enough. I think I just chill back here until I finish my uh, finish my call. Because I think he went Jack Show, right? It should be good to just stay. No, dude, this guy is done. Brain is broken. There's just no way. Okay, I take I take two more waves and I have call finished. You played quick play last night while first timing Yone top versus a master's Trinomir one trick. You suffered. Listen, man, if you play Yone and you lose, that's your own fault. That character has the most agency in the entire game. I understand he has hard matchups though. Don't get me wrong. I'm just being obnoxious. To shake or not to shake. He just he just tanked my turret to get a plate. Whatever. Good for you. Alright, I get call cash out here. Big money. Free 180 gold profit. Okay. Buy this, buy this, sell this, buy this. Actually, I'll keep it. If I can't spike to get a to get a component or an item purchase, I'll just keep it for now. But it is 180 gold in the bag, basically. Oof. Oof. So that's how he got my turret, or my plate. I was like, how did he get my plate with no minions? Because he was perma-tanking my, my tower, apparently. <laughs> what, dude? Okay. I guess we take that. Dude, his TP is actually back up, by the way. I can't get this turret. There's his TP. Okay, I'm gonna sell the call for a uh, pink ward. Very nice, very nice. This season might be the least fun you've ever had playing League. Yeah, me too. Because at least, even though season nine was the worst season ever, second worst season ever now in my opinion, at least in season nine, we had Righteous Glory. So even though we were against perma range double kleptomancy range top laners, you ever seen Kazana get CC'd like that? No, you haven't. Uh, even though we were against perma double kleptomancy range top laners, at least I had righteous glory. At least I had agency. In top lane season 2023, no agency. Items suck. Just watch your bot lane and jungle flip it every game. <laughs> Fun times, right? Hmm, my team kind of sprinting a little bit. Not sure about that one, boys. Alright, let's walk over to Drag, see what we can do, if anything at all. Damn, they got it ripped. 
Rip G. I don't know who's Flashback. I got someone's though. I think it was Yone. You started in season nine? Bro, I'm sorry. At least you got to experience season nine and ten, which had the old items. It's Yone TP bot. So I'm fairly certain Kaisa wins that. Sante Ghost, nice. I believe it is a Rift Maker game here. I'm gonna need a damage. They have a pretty pretty tanky Cassante and Zach, so. You came back from a 10 year hiatus as a top lane main? I'm so sorry, dude. Yeah, they destroyed top lane last year. They made it so that teleport has a uh, 10 minute lockout to use teleport on ally structure, or sorry, ally minions and ally wards and stuff like that. Only TP to turrets for the first 10 minutes, haha. <laughs> Riot thought that was a good idea. We can kill this guy as a group if we walk up. Or not, JK. I thought he would stay. My Zed is in danger. Can't wait to see it. At least Zach got it. Could be worse, thanks. She lived? Bruh, no way. I lived, bruh, no way. Cassante TP down. Well, Vayne has no sums. I think I'll avoid staff or at least blighting jewel. We'll see though. We'll see what to get. Gonna go Baron, I'm down. Let's do it. I am down. Wait, Vayne, Vayne jumped in poison. Wait, the Vayne just jumped in poison. <laughs> okay, cool. That works. That works, dude. 
Am I a Sinj cosplay yet? I'm not bald. I'm not thin. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I should do one anyways, though. That'd be fun. Bro, this guy's name's Proxy the Seed. Bro, just can't change the feed. Just go into the I'm going to run it down. Damn. I did damage to him, though. Oh, no, Pike. I did a lot of damage to him there. Oh! Oh, look at the assists! Oh! Very nice. Yo, Reeker, thanks for nine months, and I appreciate it, bro. Yeah, they, they killed me, but I did a lot. So, that's fine. I will just go Void Staff, I think, actually. Riftmaker plus Void Staff is a lot of damage together. Because if, if your magic damage gets amped, then your tree damage gets amped as well. Because your tree damage on Riftmaker is based off of your damage output. Shave my head for the Singe cosplay? I don't think I could bring myself to do that. I don't think I can do it, man. With a summoner named Fake Carry? Not that I remember now. I, I might have, but I don't remember. No idea, brother. Okay, the vein flash is gonna match my flash, I believe. Or it's up a little bit before, like, like a tiny bit before. I got her, I got her, I got her, kill her. Big fling. Ooh. The Drifto. Can't we just shove here, I think? I saw a flash as well. Big money. Oh, we can get butt on hip as well. Play Rift Maker 816, 24 and 9 demonic. Easy fling. Wait, she autoed me? Okay. Oh. I don't get an assist for grounding his goo his his wobblets, dude? No way. Alright, GG Top Canyon. GG Top Canyon. Dude, call singe, proxying inside enemy base <laughs> and escaping. <laughs> so stupid. Oh, I love it. I love it, I love it. Okay, let's give it to Let's give it to Lee. Nice. Yeah, there is this fight, like, right here. We're like, yeah, I died, which is a little unfortunate, but they spent a lot of time trying to go after me here, and I put out a lot of damage on them. Like, the Viego is basically already dead here, which, that wasn't all me, but that was a lot of me. And then Zed cleans up pretty hard. Then they die here. I had a huge pick on Vayne here. Just drift off the Zack with the ghost. And she dies.
Here's shove to end. Somehow I killed Cassante here, I guess, because he was just like he was greedy farming. He was he was taking turret shots to get his um to get turret plates, and he doesn't have more mugs or anything like that, so. Just ignore him. He ghosted at me here, if I recall correctly, and I dodged his Q, so he backed off. I'm trying to find when I was inside their base. Was it earlier in the game? It was earlier in the game, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. It was right here. So at seven minutes, I get inside their base, and I'm in their base until eight minutes when I flash out. <laughs> I wasn't... The thing is, I wasn't even double proxing. I'm just purely in here for the tilt factor. That's it. The Vigo's level four as well, because my Lee Sin got a camp, a camp or two of his. Probably more than a camp or two, actually, but... Juke out the stun. He has to back off to a lot of damage from me. If it's, if it's a three or four level difference and I have 12 stack conquer, yeah, I'm going to do a lot of damage even with low mana. Then when Yone shows, I'm just like, all right, chillin', chillin'. Flash. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, wait, 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 yeah. I remember I continued to proxy afterwards, too. I, I went back in for more. To, to just, just farm up my call. So I proxy that wave. Then I recalled after that wave. That is nuts, dude. So I didn't actually, I didn't actually recall until like 8 minutes and 45 seconds. Or 8 minutes and 40 seconds even. After I was already proxying, then I went in their base. Then I proxied, then I left. Then I proxied again. Then I recalled. Nuts. Actually just nuts. Rip. Wait a second. Wait a second. Spark points up, my friend. I hope you're doing well. I believe that means a level one proxy for me. I don't know if Gragas flashed. I don't think he did. I think he saved it. Akshan ignited. Did any of their team flash, though? I think they all just went over the wall. Akshan might have, but he ignited as well, so it's hard to say. Can't drop a wood there. Alright, we see her. Her Groms are up too, so... Or her Krugs, so she'll probably walk over to me here soon. Why did Gragas just body slam? Nothing. Looking for me, or... Oh shit, I'm gonna die. Am I though? Am I though? Am I? Nah, I'm out, bro. I'm out. <laughs> Bye. Dude, bot lane into bot lane. It's over. Mental is shattered. Their mental is done, man. It's over. Nah, just kidding. It's not over. They could recover easily. Sparkboy, did you like that Charizard comic? <laughs> yeah, I got that red buff too. Huge. I think I ganked though. They have no ghost on Gwen. Maybe. I have no idea. But Gargus probably has flash. I gotta be careful. No way I was pushing towards it, so I didn't use uh, TP. Ow. Bro, chill. What? How does that hit? Whatever, it's fine. Oh 
Get him, bro. Get him, bro. Nice. Very nice. Well played. So I guess he did flash earlier. He's been in the auction realm, but then he showed mid, so we're chilling, I guess. Uh, there's Ragus TP. I can't proxy here. I gotta leave. Okay. Uh, blasting one moment, I think. Well, TP here. It's a little early TP, but it's fine. There's Gwen Ghost, so she uses it there. Maybe he lives though? Nah, he's fucking dead. Sorry, bro. Rough game for you. Oh my god, no way, bro. Oh, he flashed? Okay, my bad, sorry. I'm so bad at tracking it, because I just like, my brain, I just assume every champ has mobility. It's so, like when people flash, sometimes it doesn't register to me. I don't know why he was there. That's fine though, I guess. Because you can sit there and miss all of your CS too. It's totally okay. Like, my brain just doesn't understand Flash. That's so unlucky. Oom like four times. Whatever, all good. What can you do? He has blue buff. Reduce cooldown sucks. Enemy killing Unfortunate. All good, whatever. Nah, he had Ignite still. That's wild, man. That's crazy. Whatever. I hate to go tabby here. I'd rather not. Auction is a problem, though. I think he's trying to hit me. I'm not really sure, though. Okay, you can have it. It's fine. Actually, I might roam top for me, too. Gotta be careful. Mm, damn. Gotta let him go. Bit my life, Akshan's running top right now. Nope, he's mid, JK. I lied. Damn, Thresh is here, bro. No way they kill him, right? Well, I guess two for two for three, maybe not the worst. Two for four is pretty bad, but Ugh, whatever. What can you really do? Wait, nah, it's worth, dude. That's that's three for four. Like that seems pretty terrible. And honestly it is pretty terrible, but 
Bro, this guy's name's Proxy to Feed. Us. Bro, just name change to Feed. Just going to Feed. I'm going to run it down. Hey, Minish. Greetings from the Delaroza family. We got you on the big screen for family night. Oh, God. Dad's finishing cleaning the grilling, and we are about to break out the board games. Love your streams. <laughs> Yo, Jordan, thanks for 10 months, man. I appreciate it, bro. You're gonna draw the Gwen clip? Do it. I'm excited. He's going, um. What's the one item? Everfrost. Ever Frost. Dude, yeah, fuck Mythics, Rip Bozo. They're on drag. We can probably kill this guy, by the way. Not by myself, though. Nerf Singe! Nerf Singe! Nerf Singe! He's QE. He's Q. He's gonna try and ult me back into a Q, probably. Into a body slam or something. Gotta be careful. Here it comes. JK. I'd rather not back here if I don't have to, but the problem is when he levels up, he's gonna get mana. Ow. Well, with that ult, uh, maybe he kills me. I doubt it, but we'll see. Problem is, Akshan can run top two. All I want is one more wave. Okay, Roa is up. You need to queue through the wave, bro. Nah, he's chilling. He's chilling. Okay, so I hold my TP, but with me holding TP, that means that uh, Grog is holding TP too. If it didn't say it, the Rick Master thanks, man. I appreciate it, bro. Okay, he has Everfrost. There it is. What it is. It is what it is. If I ever get the fling, I fight, but I don't think I'm ever going to find it. He just throws Q's amount of range the entire time. Yeah, just like that. Where's his ward? Oh, he messed up. He thought he was being cheeky. He fucked up. Actually, I'm pushing him pretty hard, though. Damn, bro. Whole squad showed up top. Diver, maybe? Diver? Dude, there's like seven pink wards back here. What is this? I guess she just leaves. I might be dead here, though. Nope, chillin'. Hopefully. I hear you. An enemy is legendary. Action is a problem. Oh. Damn, unfortunate. Whatever. 
Can't really fight this guy without R. We sort of stuck here. Here comes the barrel. Here comes the barrel. Here comes the Everfrost. Nope, okay. It's nearly time. Potentially here, potentially. All good. They go drag here, unfortunately. Don't think we can stop it. That shit is gone, bro. Record. A couple bottom. I think their whole team's bottom besides Yorgos right now. Knock guns mid, JK. JK. Need to leave here. Okay. He's ghosting, you think so? No way. I right, maybe. I'm playing on the account named Minish Cap 1, so anything is possible. Yikes. <laughs> I didn't even want to talk about that one. They killed her though. Nice good job. Yeah, they're fucking dead though. Dragus TP. <laughs> I had a feeling that that was a bad TP, I'm gonna be real. Damn, she was doing it already, whatever. Not gonna bother. She got the bug too. Unlucky. I'll go for the 1k. Fuck it, dude. I could have given Silas too, but I think I want to take it. Okay, maybe team can push mid. My my cane died top. Not really sure how that happened because he was kind of out, but whatever. Get bot tier one hopefully here. Decent. A lot of gold I just got. Ghost being down, kind of unfortunate, but whatever. Got to deal with it. 11-1 Akshan, man. Holy hell. How do you even begin to deal with that? That's just crazy. That is a complete pain in the ass. Even with Frozen Hardy, it's going to tear me apart. I'm only on cloth armors right now. Looks like they're coming for bot turret. Oh, they're gonna go for they're gonna go for bot tier two here with Harold, aren't they? My team walked into a fight anyways, unfortunately. I can get the issue with that R. Did I just deny the Herald? Oh my god, I did. <laughs> Get displaced. 
<laughs> get displaced, bitch. <laughs> Yo, uh, Forehammer, thanks to the Prime, I appreciate it, man. If that's a Halo reference, that's sick, by the way. That's dope if that's a Halo reference. Uh, we fight this Herald. Uh, Gwen is mana, yeah, she is mana. Hoping that was the pick. It was not, in fact, the pick. Awkward ass fight, dude. I don't know why half my team is like tunneling mid. The Thresh just spends the entire fight zoning me out. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why they're all standing over here. It is what it is, though. I can't make them walk over to me. It sucks. We get fucking Ocean Soul. Or. Ocean Soul Point. On my way. Unlucky. Dude, he's a thousand gold again, that's fucking wild. And the worst part of League 2 is like if sometimes if your team gets zoned, they won't just walk around. They'll just like keep walking into the zone and trying to outplay it. Like just walk around. What are you doing? Why even try to outplay it? You're not gonna outplay it. That's okay though. Whatever. Can't they go Baron? Gotta be careful. I hear you. My team should be pushing up mid, but they can't. Chasing him! Just take the trap. Let's take the fucking Baron. It's a game winner from the cap, bro. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Okay, Akshan's in mid. We're chilling. We're chilling, dude. I don't know why she just flashed. Whatever. You know what annoys me is when like the cannons or like whatever the minions get AOE when you have Baron and then you can all of a sudden you can't farm them anymore as singed. Sucks. All good. Okay. A little bit of MR for Gragas. I don't know if I go for the full Abyssal Mask, but for now I'm just gonna hold on to uh, the Negatron Cloak and see what happens. Excuse me. Okay. I want mid tier one. Thank you. 
I want mid tier one. Holy shit, bro. I tanked a lot there. And my cane fucks it, of course. Uh, of course he does. Because why take the free turret? You know what I mean? Why, why would you do that? What, do we have to leave? <laughs> why would you just go for the free turret when you can walk behind their, their turret and die? Dragon TP'd, or we can't hold mid. Low IQ jungler, unfortunately. It is what it is. I have goes 10 seconds after uh, Ocean Drag. They're gonna focus me super hard, by the way. Because I am by far the biggest threat on my team. Okay, Jinx just recall. These should force us here. My cane's walking up again. Fuck, dude. Nah, bro. It's a minish cap div, dude. It is. It is just simply a minish cap div. Holy shit! It's just me over and over, dude. So I need to kill that word. Uh, yeah. Season fourteen changes look awesome, man. They look absolutely dope. One k speed. I'm not sure. Maybe more at that point. Gonna get mid tier two, we get drag. Akshan, oh, Akshan flash, yeah. It's really important. Dude, maybe I do just go Abyssal. Just pump damage. Hmm, I don't know. I, hear you. I don't know. Hard to say. It will be good for Singed. Like, because we're going to actually have real items, there's a possibility Singe gets nerfed in Season 14, but even if he does, like, it's worth it to actually have items, you know what I mean? You don't want your champion to just be generically powerful. You want there to be a reason they're powerful. Because if your champ is generically powerful, then there's no separating, like, good players and bad players. Your champ's just OP, you know? I'll just go full abyssal here. Might as well. Okay, auction. I might go Randuin's also, or get his Zanya's. Maybe we'll see. He says he has a lot of fucking damage. Is the problem with him? Eight twenty-one damage block. I don't think that's the play. I'm level 18. They're coming top. I need to leave. Getting collapsed on. Wait, are they not? They're not, JK lol. I lied. There is not a fucking chance you guys are killing me, dude.
There is not a fucking chance you are killing me, dude. We need to go Baron here, 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 we need to go Baron here. It's a minish cap diff from telling you. They're gonna get turret, they're not gonna get in him. Okay, cool. Dope, dope, dope. I might just go death cap actually. They have like no MR. Hard if they focus me though. Fuck it, we ball, right? We ball. We just ball, it's fine. Death cap angle. <laughs> no, nah, I'm not gonna flame these flares. Nah, no way. No way. Maybe. Maybe they deserve it, you know? Need to kill this ward. No realize who needs it, bro. They know I'm here. I'm gonna get hooked, maybe. Let's get dragged, let's get dragged, let's get dragged. I'll hold mid. Yep, they're top. Okay, we're chilling. You can push for mid as well. Or bot. That's cool as well, yeah. They backed off really fast. Silas holds top. And we go bot as group. Oh my god, Caitlyn. The minion hold there, crazy. I think I just keep pushing here. He ran him down, bro. He ran him down. I'm going turret here. I'm going turret here. I'm going turret here. Just kidding. Nah, it's so over, dude. Triple proxy! Triple proxy! <laughs> it's done! It's a minish cap diff, bro. <laughs> Come on, Gragas. Come on, dude. Come on, bro. Whatever, it's fine. Dude, this is this is a top canyon. Holy shit, is it actually though? Yeah, it's okay, it's a top canyon. Not even close. Just hit the Nexus, please, God. Nah, bro. It's a it's a top canyon? Triple proxy. Holy shit. It's possible. All you have to do is be level 18 singe with frozen heart and phase rush and ghost. Then maybe you can triple proxy. Holy shit, man. That's crazy. Alright, who do I honor? I honor Silas for sure. Tilt proof. After his lane got inted, and that Akshan gave up multiple uh, thousand gold shutdowns, winnable. Right, let's see. What was the Gragas elo? Dude, I had 28k damage that game. He also had 28k damage. How does that make sense? He popped off way less than me. It's fine. Master Double master tier? Quad master tier? I think the Silas is on, or the Akshan's on Smurf account as well. Yeah, he's on a fresh account as well. 
Then my whole team was master tier as well. Decent, dude, decent. Was that plus plus forty in diamond still? Wild man. Crazy. <laughs> what was the score? We were down what? That was a 5k gold deficit? Yeah. Yeah, that was decent. And then the other one, uh, what was it this one? This one was where I basically became unkillable. Yeah, that one was decent too. Love to see it. Nidhogg still plays League of... Dude, hell yeah. Dude, was this really a triple proxy? Hold on. Can I can I call it triple? <laughs> is this the is this the six item sin triple proxy? I guess five and a half item. Alright, so I run over here, I grab the jinx. We we grab Jinx. She's goof lung, she dies. Here's here's phase rush. As the wave is coming in. Aw, oh, bro, that's come on. If that's not a triple proxy, I don't know, I don't know what to call it. That's that's definitely something. <laughs> that's definitely something, man. Yeah, Nidhogg's dope, man. I love Nidhogg. He's been my friend for a really long time. Super cool guy. <laughs> yeah, it's not like a perfect triple proxy, but you're not gonna get a perfect one. All three cannons, yeah. I got I got three cannons. Did I get did I actually get all three? I know I got two, but did I get three though? Did I get this one up here? No, there is another one. That one, this one up here. All right, my mouse is on it. I, like, I get these two down here. That one deagros, reagros. I have to, I have to go in and replay and find out. I don't care. I'm calling it triple proxy, dude. <laughs> it's it's a very botched triple proxy, but I'll call I'll call it like I see it, man. Jesus, that's crazy. All right, futures market unlocks at two minutes, and you get how much debt is level as at level uh, two minutes? The debt increases over time. It doesn't increase per level. What's that? Isn't the debt fifty at two minutes, or like the amount that you can borrow plus fifty gold? Uh, or sorry, minus fifty more gold for for debt. I don't know. I'm just gonna try and buy shit. <laughs> Who knows? So it's fifty plus fifty. Okay. Gotcha. So if I can get 250 gold, I can get boots on my execute. I'm probably going to skip this. Uh, wave one. Yeah. It's nearly time. I believe I am. Uh, I've been doing this more because I just don't want to lane level one with uh, without teleport because like what happens is you get I, I, I found that you get shoved and then you can't get prio again like you're under your turret for the rest of lane basically whereas this kind of prevents that a, a little bit at least okay sure thing brother Sure thing, brother. I still got my boots, though. Fuck you. Still got my boots, though. Debt is one hundred plus eight gold per minute. I thought they, I thought they changed it. Oh, painful.
was like, no way this guy recalled, right? I didn't think so. Nah, bro, you're not freezing on me. I'll flash for the wave. I don't. You're not freezing on me, dude. I'll flash for half a wave, bro. Mm -mm. Mr. Darius, I don't think so. Nice try, my guy. I'll flash for half a wave, then miss a mini on the next wave. I don't even care. I'm crazy. Mentally unstable. I'll get my Swifties at four and a half minutes. God bless Futures Market. Mwah. Plus my ghost is coming back up too, so. Useful. Very useful. So far I've gotten two spikes that I would have not had yet, normally. You know, Doran's versus Dark Seal. If I'm proxying, I'm going Dark Seal usually. Because you save money by not having to go, um... Not having to buy red potions. Interesting. They kill them? No way, hey? Nice. I thought he was gonna kill both of them for me to get out there. <laughs> I was ready for them to die so I could escape, dude. Very nice. Isn't minion DMAT better? Minion DMAT's only better if you're gonna be able to get farm, but if you're not gonna be able to farm, then what what the fuck are you DMATing, you know? If you're not gonna get farm for the first long time, then Futures Market gets you items. Right? It makes sense. Because DMAT's only effective if you're actually hitting minions. If you're not hitting minions, then... Like, what's the point? Did I get that? I got that. Oh, it's two health. Pain. Never mind. I stopped the way to get the pet. Nope. <laughs> it's a 1 in 5,500 drop chance per, per farming patch, so... It's gonna be a long time before I get it, probably. Even though that's the highest odds that you can have of getting it. I've already maxed out my level. It's just, yeah. It's gonna be a while. My luck is really bad when it comes to RuneScape drops. I remember I, I killed like 300 Tormented Demons one time way back in the day before I got a Dragon Claw drop. Then I got two of them in, like, two of them in a 10 minute span or something. But then that was like the last big drop I ever got because I, I have terrible monster drop luck. Okay. <laughs> All right, goodbye. I've gone like a couple hundred, uh, a couple hundred Barrows chest, more than a couple hundred Barrows chests dry as well. When the average drop rate for Barrows is like one in fifteen chests. Darius is missing farm for this. 
I'm just zoning him off of his Grump. I'll give up a few melee minions to zone him off of Grump. I'm okay with that. My work has altered the air. No bueno. Kane is level 5 though, and Darius is down here. Can I go for one more wave? I'm gonna do it, we ball. I wanna go Roa so badly, but I'm so scared that's gonna be bad versus Darius. But like, Roa plus Futures Mark, I can get it so fast, right? No way, I'm in combat. Whatever, Darius lost a wave for it. I'll do it. We'll do some rod gaming. Fuck it, we ball right. He probably thinks I'm going Rylize, but I'm definitely going rod. I'm gonna wait for debt here, though. Wait, no, I can't. I'm stupid, I'm stupid, I'm stupid. It doesn't build out of... I keep making this mistake. It doesn't build out of Amp Tome anymore. There's no more Amp Tome in the build path. I griefed it again. I'll just go Rally's early injuries. I keep griefing it, bro. Wait. <laughs> he died! <laughs> I did too much damage to him! <laughs> I deserve an assist for that, by the way. That's a big wave top. I don't want to lose it. Oh, uh, Kane is pissed. I'm a bit of a demon. Yeah, I keep the. I'm so used to the season 13 build path where it had Amp Tome, so I'm like, yeah, I'll just go Amp Tome, it's fine. But, it's okay. Rallies is good against uh, Darius, so I'm not too worried about it. And so is Landry's. Honestly, Landry's and Rallies is probably better this game because they have triple melee, but. I just wanted to test Roa, man. I keep griefing it, though. He lost a wave for it again. I'm still here, Darius. Dude, Shen's ganking me, Kane's ganking me. Darius is probably having a aneurysm playing against this. I mean, to be fair, you get what you deserve for picking Darius. You get you get pain, mental pain. I hear you. Your team has destroyed a turret. Oh. Maybe next time, guy. Maybe next time, hey? You tried. The cane was there too is the best part. They're trying so hard to kill me, too. It's, like, kind of funny. I love it. He's, he can't even recall, because I'm just, like, I'm just I'm just pushing already. 
Guess what? I'm already back here too. Can you can you even recall? What, what can you do? You recall, I take your turret. I have six scrub buff, bro. Dance under his turret, why not? Commit some mental warfare. He doesn't have teleport. <laughs> no, bro, yeah, I bought Amtom on accident. An enemy has been slain. An ally has been slain. That's on me. So yeah. On my way. Give me turret. Give it to me. <laughs> I love grubs, man. I love having six six scrubs too. It's so satisfying. I hear you. I guess Rylance. Or, uh, Leandris. I feel like, okay, change my mind here. Rod of Ages, if they want to buff it again, they should make a build out of two Amp Tomes instead of Blasting Wand. Right? It's, nearly time. it's so awkward saving gold for Blasting Wand. Like, the, the build path of Roa is so weird. Rampage. I think Darius is right here going to wait for me. Nope, he's down there. I'm just gonna push top. That's awkward. My Caitlyn has traps set up in front, but yeah, weird. I believe I get this though. With six scrub buff, you just kind of smack turrets. The grubs at almost one quarter of that turret's HP for me there. Like, that's so helpful. Have Leandry's money. Try the first back blasting one cheese. Oh, like buy no items or just buy like a refill potion, then get a blasting one recall. Yeah, I mean, I was doing it for a while, but I was also doing that with the old Rod of Ages too. I haven't tried it like yet this season. It, it might be good. But I feel like having no AP is so is so painful because like how do you farm, right? That's like the eternal question is how does a singe farm with no AP? I I like the cheese, don't get me wrong, it's just it's kinda hard to pull off. That's why it's a cheese, I guess. Too 
shake or not to shake. <laughs> Love your content, Pamus. I appreciate it, man. Oh, he just killed him before I could even get the assist. Crazy. My Victor has death cap? And the Ludens, what? Excuse me, hello? I gotta be careful, I think I don't have enough HP. Rose is good for mana. No, Rose is good for tankiness as well. 600 HP. And it gives you a level up so you scale faster as well. The 16. Level 16 is very important for Singed. Your team has destroyed a turret. Your strongest point in the game is level 16. And if you can hit level 16 when everyone else is level 15 or 14, you're massive. Yes, the damage is low, but the utility is high, right? Do you snatch there in movement speed? Uh, this game I went tenacity move speed. Yeah. You have to really. I think move speed is like you can play it every game, but with this with the third slot shard, you have to really weigh your options. Like, is the tenacity worth giving up 180 free HP? Because 180 free HP is a lot. That is no small amount of health. I hear you. Hello, random cane. Shit, he almost killed. Dude, the one in seven cane almost killed my victor. What? Profane Hydra, very balanced, by the way. Uh, Caitlyn Ghost Flash did. And so did Darius. Very nice. Yeah, Fusion Market feels pretty good. Like, it definitely takes you long. Don't get me wrong. It takes you longer to kill cannons, but, like, it. I feel like it's stable when you have to give up CS in a losing matchup. Like, Darius, right? Like, Singed has, like, losing matchups. Then he has losing matchups. And Darius is a losing matchup. Whereas, like, Jax is a losing matchup. You, like, you get what I'm saying? Does that make sense? My team is shoving mid with prejudice, so. Your team has destroyed an inhibitor. Why would you walk there? Legendary. 
thing. Whatever. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. I suppose I'll take it, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? And you're pushing bot with pride? That's a good reference. Good movie. I like that movie. My sister would always watch, watch like those weird ass like English drama movies. She's so into weird stuff like that, man. I'm like, just watch fucking normal people shows. You watch that weird shit, you know? I actually got Ocean Soul, nice. Is it even possible for me to die? Your ex-wife made you watch it? Yeah. My sister made me watch a bunch of like... Okay, so she got me into some really cool shows, like Psych. That was one of her favorite shows, and that show is awesome. But then she likes some weird stuff, too. Like Pride and Prejudice, which I guess is not weird, but it's very English, I guess, is a good word for it. And, like, British TV shows are, at least the drama ones are definitely a little different than American drama. American drama is, like, very obtuse, whereas English drama is very, like, subtle, and I can't follow it because my brain is American. Like, you guys got me once, you can't take me back. You can't take me back. <laughs> Dead and Fountain, see ya. What a fight, bro. Nice. Yes, dude, Psych is an amazing show. If you guys are bored and looking for a TV show to watch, watch Psych. It's about, um, it's like, it's like Mindhunter, except fun to watch. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. I tried to watch Mindhunter. That shit is boring as fuck. I tried really hard, man. That show is so boring. Psych, Psych is like Monk. But also very fun. Psych is like Mindhunter if Mindhunter wasn't boring. Psych is... It's just a great show. Awesome show. It had a great ending. Like, the seasons are awesome. Like, there's not really a bad episode of Psych. Like, it, that's really rare to say with a TV series. Like, it had a great beginning. It had a great ending. The middle was awesome. Like, all the episodes are good. Right? It's a great show. It's really good, actually. Genuinely, it's awesome. And it's funny. And the characters are good. Yeah, Psych was awesome, man. Psych is top three favorite shows in the movies that are good. I haven't watched the movies, but yeah, like, I heard that they're good, too. Fun stuff, fun stuff. All right, my back after Swifties. Would I have had enough money for Blasting Wand? So here, I don't think so. Because I died with... I died with 530 gold. I need to have 220 gold to get Blasting Wand from Futures Market. There's no way I have that much, right? What was the timestamp for that? That was 4 minutes, 30 seconds? There's no way, right? No way I have enough gold there. Not a chance, right? So I get this wave. Do keybinds always change for this? Okay, so I'm dying with how much gold? Excellent. 
Okay, I'm dead with 530 gold. We can even... Let's just even go until I spawn, alright? I spawn with... Oh, never mind. I bought an item. We'll call it 530 gold, okay? My futures market would be... 124. No, it's not enough gold. It's not enough. I'm, I'm 100 gold short. Hi, kitty cat. You guys say hi to the stream? Look, these people paid for your vet bill. Come here. Come here. I'm gonna show you. Come here, bud. Come here. I'm gonna I'm gonna debate him with some food. No, no. Come here, come here, come here. Jackson, Jackson, mother. Hold on, I'm I'm getting this cat. He's not escaping the camera attention this time. The Aatrox is walking over. It's gonna hard shove this. Oh no, he's here. Okay. Looks like Shivana outsmited the Gragas who was invading her. So that works. That's really good. I had to hard shove to make the Aatrox like want to stay up here. Otherwise he would walk over there and like kill her. Yeah, I don't know how bad the housing is in like the rest of Europe compared to like some places. I know it's pretty bad in England. I have a lot of English friends and they complain quite a bit. Like, it's bad in America, but in America, it's the worst on the coasts. In the Midwest, it's not, like, horrendous yet. It'll get worse. For sure, it'll get worse. There's a lot of zoning laws that, like, prevent, um... A lot of housing developments from going up. Which is a good or a bad thing, depending on how you look at it, but... Like, if, if you already own a home, you probably love zoning laws. If you haven't gotten a home, you probably hate zoning laws. Monsi, what's up, bro? Welcome in. I'm gonna go Leandry's this game. I can't go Cosmic, though. I don't have Aerie. I could go Demonic Riftmaker, Cosmic, Holebreaker, Fourth. Also, it's a Demonic Holebreaker. I'm very simple, man. I just want, like, a nice little suburban... First, no. Suburban life. I don't need, like, anything crazy. I'm not exactly hard to please when it comes to, like, living. If I can just chill and play my video games and just hang out with friends for the rest of my life, I'd be happy. Some people, like, aspire for a lot crazier things than that. An enemy has been slain. An enemy has been slain. That's all I want, though, in life, really. Just security, stability, and video games. I'm very complicated. <laughs> He's like, how did he get over there? Nunny? An enemy has been slain. <laughs> how did Singe do that? This guy's crazy. An enemy has been slain. Never seen a gamer like this before. No! <laughs> God fucking damn it, dude. <sighs> my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. My bad, holy shit. That was at Wisconsin. I actually have... Dude, it's so weird. I have had, like, four family members move to Wisconsin in the last year. Probably the land is cheap. I'm just like, good for you guys. Apparently it's the place to be, dude. They use TP, I believe. Mm 
take renting for the rest of my life? Man, fuck renting, dude. Renting is a trap. If you can if you can try to own property, you should. It's not even about like the, the appreciation or, or, or depreciation of it. It's like when you own something, you can like you can own it, right? Like if it, if I wanted to modify a, a rented home, I can't really do that. You know? Camille's roaming, so I'm just gonna double proxy here. I swear to god she's roaming. Look, she's roaming. My mid lane Camille's roaming, so I'm not trolling. An ally has been slain. She's quite literally roaming. Never mind, she's leaving. I'll leave that way for her. JK. Never mind, she's roaming. I'm taking it. <laughs> she doubled back, so I had to double back too. Oh, she died. But I got it though. I could technically go Roa here if I wanted to as well. I don't think I will though, we'll see. I'm not gonna die, I don't need a death here. Amptoma Ruby Curse is not gonna help me that much here. I don't think the, like, don't get me wrong, I'm praying for a housing collapse like in 2008. I don't think it's happening, bro. There's no more, like, runaway lending happening. I hear you. There are laws in place to prevent runaway lending. And the House of Cards style collapse that happened back then. An enemy has the been banks saved. are on a little bit more of a leash now. Maybe not as big as, uh, or as tight of a leash as, as they should be. But An they are leashed a bit more. Spree. So it's hard to, it's hard to hope that for that, you know? Why is there 80 carry killing my entire team, by the way? Happens, I guess, no worries. Blitz bot. Run, children. Damn. Shut down. They killed Draven, though. Nice. She's fine. I got a recall. Let me go. Very nice. Should I debt here? I should avoid it. It's not worth it. I'll debt for demonic. An ally has been slain. Dude, my bot lane is getting the treatment. Nagargus is sitting his belly down there, dude. Giovanna didn't clear the ward either, unfortunately. They might get Harold off that because she had to back off of it. Yeah, I tried finishing it, rip. Whatever. Unlucky. Have I used Phase Rush once this game? On my way. I don't think I have. The Blitzcrank there. Oh dude, trust me, I wish. I wish people would vote for candidates that are like trying to change the housing game for, for young people. 
But like the thing is, a candidate who's running on a platform like that will never get the boomer vote. Never. It will not happen until like baby boomers are dead, basically. Because baby boomers will never vote against their own self interest of like lowering their the own value of their property, right? Because if there is way more housing that is built that is affordable for people, that is safe and nice, then that lowers the value of boomer property, right? So it's hard to get a candidate like that to like to run, let alone win. I wish that was the case, but yeah, hard to say. Right, let's look for a fight. So we can do something. Very nice. It's a start. Drag is chilling over here. He's an Almino's turret, it's not worth it for me. Four and one Yone, love. With about to get turret first blood as well. I hear you. Huge. <laughs> they need to gut that champion, but they never will. To shake. Honor to shake. They're gonna wait to see how OP he is with new items. Turns out he'll be broken as fuck anyways. Soon. <laughs> then they just ignore him anyways. Which champ, Yone? The... <laughs> He's Yasuo's brother in the lore, but it's just a it's just an easier to play, better version of Yasuo, basically, is all he is. That's honestly the best way to describe him. He is easier to play and more overpowered Yasuo. Losing bot lane, dude. Oh, he's auto filled. Yeah, that'll do it. Well, GG. And then my team will hostage as well. Most likely. If I had to guess. It will most likely be a hostage scenario, boys. Wow, the only winning lane, but Gragas is always here? Whoa! Almost like jungle is overpowered and shouldn't be allowed to do this. There it is, the hostage. Yeah, again, there's a lot of land in North America. The problem in North America is zoning laws by local governments that prevent housing developments from being put up in desirable areas. Well, at least no hull breaker yet. 
Does that life steal though? Our team is fighting mid. And they died. Enemy double kill. Okay, well. I'm gonna leave. My team lost 4v3, so. <laughs> Not much I can fucking do. I, I really do think, I think season 13 is probably the worst season they've ever had. I wanted to say it would be season 9, but this is worse. This is this is actually worse than playing versus double kleptomancy range top lane every game. Has been destroyed. Because at least in season 9, we still had agency. If you could, like, somehow deal with that cancer. Like, you had ways to impact the game. But in season 13, like, it doesn't matter what you do. You don't have agency as top lane. You have to win the games that your team is even or ahead, and you lose every game that your team is not even or ahead. So you're just playing the numbers, you're just playing the odds, like you're not playing League of Legends when you play top lane in Season 13. Season 9 had a ranged top lane meta with a rune called Kleptomancy where they would just farm you for money, basically. By auto attacking you, it was really silly. This is worse than that though. Genuinely, this is worse. It's nearly time. Damn, bro. Try and push mid. I'm him! I'm fucking him, dude! Holy shit! It's just me! Is it winnable? Probably not, but I did something. I, I did something. If I can't look, surely it can't get worse, right? If I just don't look? Surely, right? Surely they don't just continue to fuck up at every opportunity, right? It can't get worse, right? <laughs> Whatever, bro. Are they going barren? Probably. Can't stop it. Uh, they haven't actually yet. They might. I don't have ult anyway, so I could do anything. Gargus is top as well. One day, my poison will do damage. Today is not that day. Oh, 
Man, I demonic is such a piss useless item, dude. If this was if this was like season ten and I had Leandries, I'm getting a quadra kill there. You know what I mean? Like demonic is so garbage. It does so little damage. It's so bad. How is this item like allowed to be a thing? What fucking crack smoking game designer thought this was a good item? Like, I'm sorry that they want to spend the entire workday jerking off to Zoe Hentai, but, like, can we have an actual AP Bruiser item? That was my question for the last three years. The answer was no. We have to wait until January to have an actual AP Bruiser item. Just one more month, boys. Actually, like, two more weeks, I think, right? Or three weeks? Two or three weeks. We're almost there either way. Slain. We're almost there, boys. To shake or not to shake. But Gragas is running top. They're already fucking here, dude. We gotta run. Yeah, I have a few season 14 videos up. You can find them if you just like search Minish Cap 1 season 14. Trust me, it's way better. It's It's not even close. Even with the horrendous PvE game quality, I can tell you that Season 14 is going to be way better than this. Season 14 is closer to Old League of Legends than it is this League of Legends, if that makes you feel better. I hear you. Dude, I am the highest level in the game, but I don't think it matters at all. Yeah, they get Baron, whatever. Let's get TP then. Oh, she stole it. Winnable. You only got mid tier one. I take bot tier one. Potentially winnable. I take bot tier one for another bounty. Your team has destroyed a turret. Enemy double kill. Oh my god, the gold income. Your team has destroyed a turret. Enemy rampage. Not worth the flash, really, but whatever. Who gonna stop me? Oh, God, decap. They killed Draven as well. It's really good. This random rogue minion is like hunting down my Shivana. Winnable? Winnable? Maybe? I'm four items. Is Sin strong? Statistically, yes. Does he feel strong? No. Yone Mama. Okay, well, I'm gonna keep pushing. I kinda have to. Can't I have to recall? Fuck me, dude. We have ult for 10 seconds. How do I hold this without R?
Is this it, boys? Can I carry a game? I'm going Zanya's not uh oh, shit. Ah rip. I'm doing something. Oh, I have Baron still too. We can get mid tier too. There's the Zanyas. Dude, late game futures market is insane. I'm gonna steal a red buff. This Ash is useless, so. I'm gonna run straight to drag. Even though with full AP, full item, Singe does this so slowly, dude. Okay, I'm walking down. I have Zanyas, but can we actually fight them? That's the problem here. I did what I could, considering I was permanently CC'd the entire time, so that's pretty decent. Killing spree. I think Shivana does dragon and my team pushes mid just to be safe, but if they want to all push. Dude, I was quite literally permanently CC'd by their whole team, and I got two kills. Brahms says Minish Cap, I just want to say. What is he? They have that! Yes! Yes! Dude, the problem says I watch your YouTube videos to go to sleep. I love you. Help. Mwah, 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 mwah. I'm him, bro. That guy you listen to to go to sleep? That's me, bud. That's me. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna honor the I'm gonna honor the Brom. Dude, let's go. Tilt proof. Tilt proof. I'm, I'm him, baby. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, the 32k damage game no, no big deal no big deal dude that's fine 32k damage they had dude they had 8300 gold lead jesus then 8300 gold look, look at these fights by the way so there's this fight in mid where i, where I get i get i get a thousand gold draven then i think 600 gold yone right yeah no he was so he was 700 i think yone was a thousand here right I believe so. Okay, so he goes back. He's taking a lot of damage from me and Shivana. Flash fling through the wall. And there's the thousand. Plus I lived here, I think, right? Yeah, I lived. They got the assist on Aatrox as well. I back for Riftmaker and Rylice components. I fight top lane. I almost kill... Except Demonic is the worst item in the game, so I didn't kill. I killed Gragas here, though, eventually. He died to uh, Demonic. I think here, yeah, he died. Okay. Then I go back for Rylice. Run this guy down. Often do stream. I try and stream every night. That doesn't only happen that often, though. Run this guy down. Thank you, Riftmaker. Then, this Blitzcrank is like laugh taunting me here, so. I kill him. Then I almost run the Aatrox down too, but I'm drawing massive pressure here for that. I had to recall because uh, they were going to push our mid inhibitor. I wonder if I could have killed this guy. I don't know, dude. I had fully charged Rift. Maybe I do kill him. That's so hard to say. I think next fling kills him, but like, if this messes up, then they, then they end the game is the problem. Because like, they're they're literally on our, on our tier 1 and, uh, sorry, tier 3 top and mid here. So I have to recall to hold it. Then I have to fight here in mid while my ult is down. So this is the mid lane fight that I survived. This is the cloth armor diff, diff by the way. Watch this. Almost perma CC'd, but I pop the R. Rift Maker pops on. Oh my lord. 
That's actually a cloth armor diff, by the way. Another thousand from Yone, by the way, there. So I'm just dummy thick right there. And then I, uh, the Draven dodges the arrow, but I just ghost at him. Works out. Nice. Bam, bam. Now here's the last fight. This is the last fight. I'm literally permanently CC'd the entire time and I killed two people. I'm just like desperately trying to fling one person here so I can get phase rush and run away. I eventually fling, uh, was it Aatrox? But then I'm just still CC locked. Pop the Zhonya's at one health. <laughs> Himon and Pumbaa. Himbuk too. Valuable anti-Yone shorts content? Fuck Yone, bro. Draven doesn't because of cloth armor? Oh, here in mid? Or do you mean, oh, whenever I ghost at him? Is this actually cloth armor diff? Oh my god, it might actually be. Did he, did he auto me once or twice? This could actually be cloth armor diff. If it's one auto, I don't think it's diff. If it's two autos, it's probably cloth armor diff. It's cloth armor diff. It actually is. Yes, he has collector. If I take like three more damage, I'm dead. Actually, though, that's nuts. GG. Alright guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to deal with what is quite possibly the second most annoying thing that anybody can do to you as uh, as a singe top. That is pick a mage top lane. Uh, so normally Vayne top lane is probably my number one pet peeve as singe alongside, you know, stuff like Quirky, or not Quirky, um, Teemo and things like that. But especially AD carries top lane is super annoying for singe. But the second most annoying thing is a mage because they have wave clear, crowd control, and they can poke you. Um... Mages generally do not have as high of all-in potential. They kind of require you to overcommit to things, and then they'll kill you. But in top lane, the thing is you kind of have to overcommit for CSing and trading purposes. So playing versus Anivia is actually quite irritating um, in the lane, especially Anivia in particular, because she can also just get level 6 with her tier and then just start perma farming. There is Anivia in that bush. I just saw her. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you guys how to power proxy the lane we're gonna try our absolute best for here to start with the tier but for the first few waves she does have electrocute she'll probably be able to, to do a lot of damage to me here i gotta be really careful trying to avoid an auto attack or two so she walked late with her wave so i'm gonna use that and just start shoving the wave if she didn't walk late if she walked with the wave i was probably uh my intention was fully to just uh ignore the wave and oh she missed her uh electric timing my intention was to just ignore the wave and then just skip the wave and proxy like just skip wave one and proxy wave two but she was late so i get to just push which is nice. One thing to remember about Anivia too is she also has the um, 600 range, or is it 550? I think she should be, no, no, she's 600 range autos, yeah. 600, because uh, uh, Caitlyn is 650. I remember it was a big deal that Anivia was um, 600. There's Electrocute, no worries. Gonna go ahead and walk right past this. And look for my proxy here. And one thing you have to know, or you have to remember about playing versus matchups like this, is whenever it comes to like the enemy jungler, you're probably going to die. And there's probably going to be dying that happens to you. You see how Nivia is walking down towards me, so... Just going to go ahead and leave. Execute, most likely. An enemy has been slain. I missed my cannon, but she also missed like basically an entire creep wave almost, and then the cannon is uh, still alive to push back towards me. And then, yeah, so she, she missed, uh, she missed 4 CS and a cannon because of me. Which, like, it doesn't seem like a lot, but she did miss the cannon as well. And technically, I'm not missing CS because all of that, all of that would have died no matter what. That CS that I was never going to get. But what she missed is CS that she could have definitely have gotten. My cannon did die, but that's okay. Because bear in mind, for chasing me, she also doesn't get EXP. Players players who picked stuff like this, they generally want to be able to like bully their their lane opponent, assuming they pick something like Singed, right? Normally when you when you pick an Anivia top lane, she counter picked into me. But normally when you pick an Anivia top lane, what happens is um you're playing versus like a Camille or Irelia or a Fiora and they can kinda like deal with you as a range champion by all laning you and stuff like that. Singe does not have that option. She's holding every ability here to try and hit me. Watch out for it. Because I have no flash either, so. Here comes the wall. 
No wall, really? Okay, the ghost. Okay, we get her ignite. I thought I dodged that so I could maybe kill there. That's very unfortunate. Ooh! Ooh! Oh, there's a cane here, no way. I get her egg, maybe, at least. I want Kane to get the kill, I don't want anybody to get it. <laughs> okay, I got her egg. <laughs> that is rough, but... Damn. I'll figure it out. I'm gonna, um, I'll most likely just rush Merc Treads here, by the way. It is, like, by far the best boost for this game. They have Aurelian Soul, they have, uh, Zyra and Anivia. I'm gonna ping her, uh, Flash Ignite. Her egg is down as well. But I'm not expecting a gank. I'm just letting Ringer know in case you're in the area. Very hard to gank for a singe when he's when he's proxying. So it is what it is. Also, I'm gonna demat um one melee two can in this game. So you wanna have the melees dematted for farming purposes. She knows I'm in here. She saw me. But I can't hex flash it. And, uh, and get onto her. That way. Good fling. Should be a dead Nivea. Looking to stack up for the stun. Very nice. Let's go. Good jungle gank, bro. I wasn't even expecting it, but he gave it to me. Okay, return to proxy. I'm actually ahead of her in CS right now. She has no teleport, so that's very punishing for her to die like that. Now she loses the full wave and the cannon, and probably more CS afterwards, too, because I'm proxy. Massive, massive, massive play. But wait, I'm not done. I'm going to walk in here. I'm going to recall, or pretend to recall at least. We'll see what she does. She walked ahead of the wave. So now what you do is hex flash over the wall and just farm it up more. She's actually not ulting the wave, so that's interesting. I think she wants to, to deny that plate. That's fine, that's fair. See, so she's walking down now. She's gonna ward the uh, ward the tri bush or look for me, either or. She is in fact looking for me, so I'm gonna keep uh, looking for my execute here. W down for Nivea right there. Most likely what's going to happen is I'm going to um, execute right here. I think she was standing right here looking for me, so she loses another full wave for that. I am up 20 CS now. You need to bear in mind, two of my deaths are executions here, so. There is the ult. That's what I was waiting to see. Yeah, initially going into this game, I wanted to go, uh, it was supposed to be a, a build video about a, uh, Roa Cosmic Drive build that a viewer had me try that actually felt really good, but it might be a bit late for Roa. We'll see. I would like to do it if I can, but I don't know if the game's gonna last that long. The idea behind the build is that it just scales really, really well. I can probably kill her with Flash here, knowing she's Flashless. Tower shot too. Goodbye. I even messed up my goofling and killer. Love to see it. Can probably get this plate here. The other one was denied by minions, unfortunately, but this one not so much. Yeah, if I feel that I have time to do uh boy, A move, it's weird. Roa Cosmic, I'll do it, but no. <laughs> one HP on it because I messed up an auto attack. Damn, that sucks. Whatever. I was using A move, so I just assumed that I got it. Actually, no, I did get the plate. She messed up her uh, her Q. Messed up her her wall too.
It's probably killable, but Ringer is on a uh, Herald. I don't want to walk up there without team though, so. Just end up dying. <laughs> she got greedy for me. I'm gonna steal that kill too. She got greedy for me. She also missed her plate. She's having a really bad time. Just, you know, you deserve it. You picked a Nivea top line. I have no sympathy for you. No way. No way. No way. No way. No way. <laughs> the easiest hex flash escape of my life, bro. <laughs> the timing on that. He put a pink ward in the bush too. Alright, you know what? Just for you guys, I will go, uh, I will go Roa. Just for you guys. Yeah, that guy's pissed. Cosmic Drive, actually, also, I hope they fix the bug soon. Where it doesn't proc properly with abilities, but if for whatever reason it does proc with, um... Uh... It procs with, um, Rift Maker and Shadow Flame. Both of those items just happen to make your Cosmic Drive work, so... Her flash is up and her ignite is up. A lot of mana she's using. <laughs> Does she beat me though? Like, I have a lot of HP and her ignite's down. She put a word down, she's walking away. I see you. You better walk around. There's her Q stun. I'll walk to proxy now. Then I know where she's going. Well, this guy is thirsty, so he'll probably walk to kill me. Yeah, see how he's not under his tower? That means he's walking over for me. So, happy to execute. <laughs> this guy is such a loser, man. Picks a Nivea top lane, can't get any kills on the Singed. Chases the Singed. I still, and I still get 11.30 Roa. Not the earliest thing by any means, but... It's still, it's still well within reason to get the fast Roa. She's on components. She's going Leandry's, looks like. No boots on her, too. If she stays in lane uh, after this wave, I can probably look to, to, look to kill. Because I have Ghost Up. But she has like zero mana. Can she push this? I guess she can with one alt cast. I'm not ulting for some reason though. There it is. She queued it. Okay, see her recline. Can't really stop it though. But no worries. I want to look for a base proxy as well, if I can. Probably around Dragon time. Not not enough to troll Corgi, just whenever he's um, walking over for drag. Does she have boots yet? Nope, just fully injuries. Okay. No worries. Who needs boots? I'm one of the slowest champs in the game. Not her, apparently. Goodbye. Leandries is still not enough to uh, one shot me though. You gonna need more health, uh, more damage on that, bud. Turret plating will soon fall. We can get tower first blood here with Rengar. Or not. I'm all good. Freaking Kane, man. Okay, grab this wave. Bye bye. 
I'm just gonna walk right through here. If I walk through jungle, he will probably kill me, so just walk through the tower. And, and pull off my escape. Could have maybe stayed to kill that tower. Uh, I didn't realize how fast she was or how slow she was back to lane, but it's all good. Aether Wisp for Cosmic Drive. Now I got some movement speed. The Robo Cosmic Drive is like a scaling build, by the way. Sorry, I should have mentioned it earlier. I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make a, its own video about this probably, but for now, I will let you guys know it's a scaling oriented build. You get 200 AP off of two items, and then you go Demonic Third. Oh, please go for that tower. Well, I don't have ult, but do I need it? Hey, okay, Mr. Q, very nice. Interesting wall. Kill. And the idea is that Rod of Ages and uh, Cosmic both give you movement speed. She's in that bush, I think. Or she's back here, yeah. That you use to get really fast. You have heavy amounts of health from Roa, which helps solve the non-health factor from Cosmic. And they both synergize with each other. You know, because double movement speed. She's saving her abilities, but she's like missing her, her farm because of it. So I'm not going to complain. Wait for her to cue the, uh, cue the wave here. I don't think she will. Maybe she walks with the tower. Maybe she will. Maybe I can bait her into this. Will she go for it? The cannon's alive for a bit. I can hold. Oh, she's walking mid. I was hoping she would go for it, but, <clears throat> excuse me, she sure did not. Yeah, assuming she recalled for boots or something, I'm just going to keep uh, pushing. Because I think at this point, if she walks up to me, I'm going to just all in her. Speaking of... I'm like quite literally too fast for her. Oh, hello, Aurelian Soul. Okay, bye. Cringe, dude. Low testosterone stick together, apparently. No worries, no worries, no worries. As you can see, your your damage is like not even that much lower than if you had a demonic. Like it's it's definitely lower than if you had demonic, but. Your versatility and usability is way higher, and then you're going to go Demonic eventually anyways. Then you have all the benefits of Roa Cosmic while also having Demonic. Colton 60 here. Oops. Okay, I want to go for Herald here, but it's a little dicey. He's backing up really fast. Okay. Or Corky has package. This is probably we just win the game here. She's walking up this far because Kane is here. That's like the only reason. Oh no, she's actually down there. She's just brave. Yeah, I don't think you can kill me, Navia. You can poke me, but can you kill me? Grab this. What Ringer is going for? Her. I don't think he's gonna get her, but we'll see. He in fact does get her. He gets her very quickly, actually. Yeah, I'm used to Anivia's like building row and stuff like that. I guess I guess Leandry's does make sense, but Killing spree. you're definitely way 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 squishier. Kill. Also, Roa and Anivia is like from back in the day when you can go Roa and Leandry's. Now you have to pick one. 
delete mythics, by the way. Your team has destroyed okay, Herald's going down. I have 225 AP. Definitely a decent chunk. I'm gonna recall here and get my cosmic. I'll put the stats tab on for you guys so you guys can see the uh, the movement speed. But I'm gonna I'm gonna make a, a specific video just about this build, which I think is quite fun. Ward. Then we go for a demonic. 2.8k health. Very nice. They're probably thinking, oh, we'll go late game with the Nivea Soul Win, will you? Versus Ghost Flash Singe, I can pick either one off. Oh, I guess he can too. Let's get Baron, boys. The Singed Baron bug, uh, where you can't poison it, is still not fixed, but next patch, hopefully. Apparently what happened is that the uh, the file got randomly deleted. I swear to god. This is this is what this is what they're saying is that the sin the file that makes singed poison hit baron was just randomly deleted during some uh, script cleanup. Or they're just uh, making the code less convoluted basically, so it was an accident. Still. It's a pretty big accident. I hear you. I fucked up my pathing. I'm exhausted? Bruh. Alright, goodbye, Zyra. Dude, this cane would be here. Okay, I'm out. <laughs> yeah, as you can see, very, very, very fast. It's not, it's not even full stack Roa yet. I'll be faster on full stack Roa. You can be, you can be a bit of a menace. Dude, they're thirsty for me. Now I have full stack Roa. Also, I'm 8.5 CS per minute versus this right now. That is quite high. And the fact that she, like, kept chasing me is like it too. Also, for some reason, I don't know if it's a bug that happened this patch, but it feels like pathing is bugged. Like, your character just randomly stops pathing to wherever you clicked. I don't know if I, if I actually messed that up. I wasn't conscious of it, but I probably just messed it up. Happened to me a lot, though. Cannon. Level 16. I'm gonna go for this guy. They just saw me. <laughs> they finally hit me. We got that Baron Cannon, dude. Oh, they're gonna kill it, rip. Here we go, mid tower. I'll walk up to this wave and push it in. I think Ringer just killed someone. Yeah, the Aesol and Nivea wave clear are definitely annoying. But we can deal with it. Ouch. Zaya gets mid inhibitor, maybe. Oh, no, rip. We're getting a lot of value right now, though, with this uh, duo push. Maybe it comes top for me instead of mid for Zaya. Okay, that's a choice. 
<laughs> why are we not stopping the Zaya here? Oh, she's not even hitting it, that's why. And he's dead, goodbye. I wanted that kill so bad, unfortunate. Casual double proxy in their base right here. I might go for one more, actually. Their team is dead. Zyra is very thirsty for me, though. Ah, uh, A-Soul, that's why. Okay, go ahead and reset. I have Demonic here. Orky is TPing straight to their base. See what's happening here. Demonic. I can go for whatever right now. I can do uh, Death Cab. I can do Roa. Kills two, dies. Giga Chad. Oh, he stopped a recall. Very nice. She already used her dodge. And she's just dead. Yeah. 376 AP. 3.4k health. Very nice. I'll be super fast, too. Need to make sure to get hit by a uh, Anivia Egg or Anivia Q thing. I'm good. Measly auto attacks Anivia. I have Flash coming up soon, that's why I want to like be aggro here. Want to make a play? <laughs> I got the fling on Zyra. You are so dead, dude. <laughs> I'm just so I'm so fast, she just gave up. She was like, yeah, whatever. Hello, Neela, how are you doing? Hello, Asol. Bye-bye, Asol. Oh, is he flying? He's flying, bro. My ult's down, I'm still so fast, dude. <laughs> love it, man, love it. He says, get over yourselves, bro. You picked Anivia top lane. You get over yourself. I'm a hater. I don't care. Minish Cap is the ultimate uh, hate gamer. List of things I hate. Fiora. Range top laners. Camille. Female league characters that have swords in top lane. Actually, Irelia is okay. Irelia is okay. Yeah. Not a lot of hate for Irelia. I, I, I like Irelia. <laughs> Alright, boys. What did we end with? Let's see. I ended with... Where is it? Where's my game? For some reason, my OBS keeps glitching. Okay. I ended with 8.7 CS per minute versus the range top winner. Not bad. Six, four, and five. Love to see it. Where's my my damage though? Here we go. Not the craziest damage, honestly, but eight point five CS per minute. You know, not uh not terrible. Where's my? I wish that the in-game client would show you CS per minute, but I have to look at poor professor to see like exact CS per minute. That being said, still very good CS per minute. So. Hope you guys know that one. I'll catch you the next one. Peace, guys. Next one should hopefully be the uh, the Roa Cosmic, like, full deep dive. Um, that's, my, that's my plan. We'll see how that goes. But thanks for watching, guys. Did you preach? I'll catch you the next one. Later, everyone.